Here we're going to solve this equation. We have 11m squared minus 14m is equal to 0. As we can see, we have the square right here, right? m squared. Whenever we have m to the second power or even higher power, we should do this by factoring. Especially, you see the m twice. So, by looking at this right here, we have the m squared here and the m here, right? We can first factor out an m. So let's put that down right here. And this is 11, this is 14, just a number, not a sign, okay? Unfortunately, we don't have a common factor for these two numbers except for one, but you don't need to take out one. So I'm just going to factor out the m, and then open the parentheses for the remaining part right here. The first part right here, originally it was 11m squared. Well, the 11 stays because we didn't take out any number, but then m squared, that's the original. We took one out right, m to the first power, so we have m to the first power left. And then for the second part here, bring down the minus, the 14 also stays, but this m, we factored it out already, so this is what we have. And be sure, you remember, this is an equation, equals to zero, we have to continue this right here. So, this is good, when we factor things out, and the right hand side is equal to zero, we can use the zero product property. This means I'm going to set each factor that has the m to be zero and the other one to be zero as well. First, I will set this factor, which is just the m by itself, I will make this equal to zero. And in fact, I'm done because this is one of the solutions. And the other one, we have the 11m minus 14. We will set this equal to zero as well, and we just have to do some work right here. Let's add 14 on both sides, so that they cancel, and then we have 11m, this is equal to positive 14. This is 11 times m, so we have to divide both sides by 11, so that we can get the m by itself, which is 14 over 11. I cannot reduce this, right? So at the end, be sure you include both answers. So let me make this clear. We have two answers. m is equal to 0 or m is equal to 14 over 11. Be sure you include both numbers for the answers.